For seven seasons, audiences have loved watching the women of Litchfield Prison in the groundbreaking series, Orange is the New Black. Yeah, this includes Blanca, played by Laura Gomez, who now faces more trouble than ever in an ICE detention center. Take a look. Why don't you just get this? Nothing here is free. Not even a 1-800 number. You need to buy a phone card from the machine with money. Do you have any money? No. Do you have any money? Yes. I have $30 left from what came from down the hill. And Laura is with us now. Welcome. Hi. Thank you for having me. You had quite a season playing Blanca. <sighs> yes. Yes, indeed. Yeah, the final one. How hard is it to say goodbye to her? It's been, for all of us, of course, it's a bittersweet moment to say goodbye to a seven-year you know yeah. part of your life and feels like the end of an era but it also felt so satisfying to leave on a high note especially a show that had been uh, so important for the audience and it was it was necessary for us to leave in these terms that we have you know left yeah so yeah. without giving it away for people who haven't seen you know those final episodes yeah. um, are you happy with the way that the story ends for Monica? I am very happy with pretty much everything I um, as everybody knows at this point, it has been a very well received uh, season. We are dealing with uh, immigration issues mm -hmm. on a deeper level. And I feel that uh, Blanca's storyline, um, it's heartbreaking, but also it gives so much insight as to what's going on in, in these times in yeah. the U.S. in regard to that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, because the show brought current issues to the forefront, because it showcased women from all different backgrounds, mm -hmm. it had to be pretty special for you to be a part of that. And did you realize from the beginning that it was going to have such an effect on people? You know, it has? I did have a feeling after the ending of season six, I mean, the overwhelming response mm -hmm. we got and how heartbreaking it was to see Blanca being detained by ICE at yeah. the end of season six. Uh, was already giving us an idea that this going on and moving on into that direction was not just going to be overwhelming, but it was also important for yeah. us to do. And I'm very grateful to have been a, a part of that. Yeah, and you're very passionate about immigration issues. You started this hashtag, mm -hmm. Immigrant Stories by Laura Gomez. What has the response to that been? You know, this was somewhat inspired by my by the overwhelming response of the ending of season six. Mm. I, I got so many messages about Blanca's being detained by ICE and how unfair even a hashtag was created, a free Blanca. And I felt so, um, in, in a way, I don't, it, it was just emotional yeah. for me. And one day I was just talking to a friend. She had a shirt that said, immigrants, we get the job done. And we were talking about it. Yeah. And it just, I just felt compelled to be, to, to, to uh, share positive stories about, um, immigrants who are creating an, a positive impact in American yeah. society and it was like my response to all this demonization of immigrants being an immigrant myself yeah. but also a human being yeah yeah <laughs> well and you you have a lot of fans too and they send fan art you can see some of it on your yes. Instagram do you, do you have any favorites any favorite fan art oh look this fan one story? <laughs> over the years uh, this is a very faithful fan her name is Vit Victory Haig and she has created some of the most amazing fan art we have received throughout the years. She was actually featured among the fan art uh, that uh, the show itself and Netflix ex itself sh chose. And she has been amazing. But I've gotten so many. I got yeah. this guy, actually, it wasn't a, a fan art, but it was actually an homage. And he dressed as Blanca Flores for a Halloween. <laughs> and I remember finding that randomly online. I, it, it's been our fans are so yeah, faithful yes. and so amazing. Well, yeah. no one rocked a unibrow like you. No. <laughs> No, no, they that's did. <laughs> that is that's true. right. That's true. <laughs> well, you can catch Laura in Orange Is the New Black streaming on Netflix right now. Congrats on everything. Yes, thank, thank you so much for having me. <laughs>